back to our show. Uh, this is the Do It Yourself show. And I, I gotta tell you, I, this is one of my favorite shows to do all year. Um, you know, this is the first year of, actually the first show of the year. I'm gonna take my helmet off because it's getting a little hot. Um, but we love this show because we fill it with all kinds of things that are gonna allow you to save a lot of money by doing things yourself. And what we put together in this hour is we basically put together four of my favorite items. I think they're the best, most affordable uh, do-it-yourself items from last year. And we got something brand new. I wanna show you the item that I have brand new. It comes to us from Wagner. Uh, this is their Wagner power paint system. We have all kinds of Wagners. I have uh, I have the middle of the road Wagner. We have a starter Wagner, and then we have this one. Uh, this is the top of the line. This is the one that paints better than any other one that we carry here. It has great capacity, but what people love about it is the compressor is down on the floor. So what that means is you're not carrying the weight of the paint plus the weight of the compressor in your hand. You're literally holding about a pound in your hand. That's all you are, and you are going to dial in the most perfect results that you have ever seen. If you if you love to do do it projects if you like to do like you know painting tables painting chairs painting the deck you can use stain all different kinds of paint and here's the best part I think why everybody loves it five minute cleanup that's all you do. You pour the residual paint back in the bucket, you rinse it out, and you, can, and you run some water through the line. That's all you do. It has never been easier. That is my pick in the show. That's coming up a little bit later. So if you want to do some great do-it-yourself products, we'll have that for you. But I'm going to start you off with my favorite, all right? And I love this. You all know how much I love the work zip snip. I think it is, is easily one of the greatest tools that, we've, uh, that we offer here at HSN. It virtually will cut through anything. And I mean paper, it cuts through cardboard if you're breaking down boxes, construction paper, uh, AstroTurf if you're cutting that. Uh, you know, all the boxes that you got throughout the holidays, it's gonna break those down as well. I call it the ultimate cutting tool. If you don't have it yet, you need to get this thing right now because it is amazing. And they put it on sale. Normally it's always over uh, $32 today and it's, gonna, and it's gonna go up to 35. Today we dropped it to $29.95. So whatever it is you're cutting, and I'll show you a few examples before Matt comes up. I used it all season just to do uh, wrapping paper because what I love about, you know, wrapping paper is very delicate and so it easily tears. And I'm gonna go right through there and show you, look at how clean that cut is right there, all right? I didn't shred anything. If I'm going lengthwise or I'm going across, all you do is start it and you go right through. It is that easy. A little bit, there you go, right there. If I want to cut construction paper, absolutely no problem. If I want to cut cardboard, watch this. I mean, this is just, it, it's so amazing. Look at that. It goes right through cardboard. Look at how clean that is. And it'll even go through leather and I'll show you that in a minute, but let me get my special guest out today. He is my good friend, Matt Davis. Matt Davis standing by. Hey buddy, welcome to our show. I, you know, this is probably, not easily top five all-time items I've ever got from HSN. Absolutely, guy. Great to see you. Happy New Year. And I'll tell you this, we're starting it out right with the zip snip, one of the top tools ever here at HSN because it solves a problem, right? No more having to worry about the scissors and, and your hands cramping up. No more Mr. Rusty, right? The, the box cutter. You don't need to worry about that. With the zip snip, you can cut through just about anything. This is cordless. This is rechargeable. No batteries to buy. Don't worry about an extension cord. The zip snip is the one for you. Just press the button on top for safety. Give it a gentle squeeze, and it gives you all the power that you need right at, the, at your fingertips. All you do is look at that. I'm going through. This is actually like carpeting. Look at this carpeting material. So simple, so easy to use with the zip snip. This is uh, like a vinyl sheeting that is perfect for putting it uh, like up in cabinets and things like that. I can do that with the zip snip as well. Cordless and rechargeable. This is the one for you. Guy, we talk about feats of strength. I know we've done a lot of demonstrations together. This one I couldn't believe when I got this. This is a leather belt. This looks like some kind of disco leather. I don't know. But look at this, a leather belt cuts right through it like a hot knife through butter. That's what the zip snip is all about. Get this home and you're gonna love it. If you're a crafter, by the way, I saw we've got a crafting event coming up. Get this home, you're gonna absolutely adore yeah. this product. It, one of my favorite things is it gets better and better as you get it home. First of all, I love, Matt, that I never have to worry about putting batteries in this. It is cordless, but it's rechargeable. I have had mine for two years. I've only charged it at one time. So it really gets you a lot of life on the battery. And if you come in close to the unit that I've got here, I wanna show you something that's a really, really, really big deal. So, you know when you buy scissors, scissors get dull over time, right? And then you're like, well, I'm gonna bring it to the scissor sharpening guy, wherever, I, I don't even know how to find a scissor sharpening 
seasoning guy. Right here, there is a little block right there, right down there, you see it? As I turn this, that little block is sharpening the blade. You see it right down there on the bottom? It's got two little rivets in it. Every time I spin this, the blade is getting sharp. So I never have to sharpen the blade. And that is why, like to Matt's point, if I wanna go through leather, I mean, honestly, and you know how thick, this is a thick leather belt, and I'll hold it, and I'll show you. I mean, it goes through it like nothing. One of my favorite items, it never leaves my, uh, my uh, dining room table mat because I use it for everything. Um, I get a lot of deliveries, and a lot of that stuff comes in that awful clamshell packaging, and that is this stuff, mm -hmm. which is the bane of, of most people's existence. You ever try to open one of these things? You break a nail, you try to use regular scissors on it, all you're gonna do is dull your scissors. All you do is give it a little start, like that, and it goes right through. And there's your clamshell packaging open. Sure. Don't be afraid Absolutely. about giving it a little push. If you've got double layers of plastic, it just gotta get its teeth in there and it'll go through right away. We are very busy, $29.95, one of the best purchases you'll make if you're a do-it-yourselfer. You will love it, and look at Matt. I mean, Matt, cardboard, we're all recycling. Hey, uh, Perfect for cardboard. Oh yeah, absolutely. Perfect for cardboard. You saw me, I was cutting those straps. You know, when you get the big stuff, you get those straps uh, that, are, that are made not to break, right? So they're great when you're shipping something, but when you get it home, what a pain. How about pizza boxes? I don't know, maybe it's just me, but I always have a lot of pizza boxes for the recycle. If you wanna break them down, it's so easy. Look at this. And remember, I love what you said, Guy. This is sharpening itself as it moves. It's 260 rotations a minute, which is about four cuts, four rotations of that razor sharp blade every single second. So think about that. How about for dog food or cat food? You get one of these big boxes here. I'm gonna turn around this way and look at this. You don't have to worry about, did I find the right spot for the dog food? Look at that. Fido is ready to go. <laughs> she is gonna get fed right away with the zip snip. For all the, the light work uh, you can use it for, you can use it for regular paper, yeah. you can use it for opening the mail, but you can use it for all the tough stuff too. You know the what else? zip snip is a winner. I, what I started using it for that I never did before was like opening up bags of chips, bags of crackers, anything. Uh, if you've got, like I just uh, put some grass seed out in my yard and those bags are a nightmare to open up. And if you try to open them up with your hands or God forbid your teeth, which is not a good <laughs> right. idea, uh, you're gonna wind up trashing the bag and then you gotta go get a twisty tie and deal with all that stuff. You're never gonna have to deal with that. It goes through anything. And it is really a variety of different materials. This is, this is like an AstroTurf material, and you see how thick that is? You guys come and clip. That's a really thick piece of material, and I've got plastic on the bottom of it. And all you do is when you hold it, just go right through. I'm trying to hold it at the same time. I mean, and I want you to see how clean that is, all right? That is, that is the difference. You know, if you try to do that with scissors, you'd never get through there. And then you'd have, you'd have to get new scissors because you'd probably trash them. You'd never be able to cut leather with a regular pair of scissors. Yeah, I have industrial scissors that I use, uh, you know, for, for cutting chicken and things like that. This is for all those other materials that you need to cut. Even if it's just, you know, even if you want to, you know, just open up mail and you, you don't want to cut your fingers, you don't want to deal with that, you can do that with it as well. Variety of different things. We put it in the show, as I said before, because I think nobody, when you get it home, you'll get it. And I know it's not cheap. All right, even at $29.95, yeah, you can go buy a pair of scissors for five bucks. But you're gonna be, they're gonna be dull in a matter of time and you're not gonna be able to go through the same materials you can go through with this. Get it home. Uh, if you wanna get it less, what do we got, Jared? A $10 uh, HSN credit card offer? $10 off, get it for $19.95. FlexPay is only $9.98. Grab it, I'm telling you, you're gonna love it. Matt, we got about a minute left. Show me some more, buddy. I'll tell you what, I, I'm, I, I'm making mincemeat out of this clamshell packaging. You know, they call it clamshell. What it is, is, let's face it, it's made so that people don't borrow the product, you know what I mean? Like on a retail shelf, it's made to, to display the product. Look at that, it's falling right out. It comes right out. I get right into any package, and it's, it's made so that you can't get into it at the retail store and, uh, you know, borrow it. But when it comes to getting it home, you want to get it done, get it, get it quickly cut open. Yeah. This is the way to do it. No more box cutters, no more uh, needing to use your brute strength like Guy Van can with regular scissors. This is the great equalizer. Get the works home. Hey. This is the one. Hey. Lightweight hey. and rechargeable. You're going to love it. Even if it's just pizza boxes, right? You know the things That's that take right. up all I'm that room? You. All that room in your garbage can or recycling bin, you'll be able to cut it down and you'll be able to do it in a matter of seconds. And the most important thing that I wanted to mention 
it's really easy on your hands. So if you're a senior out there and using scissors can be really hard, all you do is just give it a squeeze. That's all you need to do. Very, very easy. Uh, 741273. Is Matt not hanging out for our next item? I thought Matt was hanging out for the next item. Let me see what I... He is, all right. M Matt, everybody wants to say goodbye to you in the, in the control room but me. I want you to stay because I know you're doing the next item. <laughs> hey, really quick, I want to talk about something that I think is important. These are the, uh, the double-sided alien mounting strips. They are perfect for doing any type of, uh, like, runner that you may have. You could use them in your car to put your phone up there. Um, anything that you don't want to move around or slip around, you can utilize these. Look, this guy's hanging a bird feeder on the window. And they are removable. Um, better than a nail, better than ordinary tape because it's double-sided, and you can easily remove it. Great for your car. These are only $19.95. You get a boatload of these. You actually get a 210-pack uh, of the strips, uh, 765095. You can use them to hang anything. Those are, uh, we're not going to do a full presentation, but I wanted uh, I wanted you guys to see those things. All right, we are going to move on. Matt Davis is going to stay with us. Uh, so this is all about doing it yourself. Uh, I don't know how many, uh, how many of you out there have an industrial toolbox. Uh, maybe you do. Maybe you're, you or, or your partner does. And it's kind of a pain to have to pull it out every time you have to do a job or a task. Let me just tell you, this thing is awesome. It comes to us from Works, one of my favorite companies. I have a lot of uh, Works product, uh, items that I use in my gardening show. This is their uh, is basically their, uh, their um, driver, what we call their SD driver. It is 4 volt. You get plenty of powder power. What's wonderful about it is you never have to switch out the bits manually. The bits come in a six pack. Each one of those bits are in a little cartridge and I'll show them to you right here. So this is the cartridge right, right here and you'll see if you come in close, all the bits are preloaded. You get every bit you would ever need. See, they're right in there. And then basically what we do is we take those bits and we put them right inside the, the uh, driver right here. And this is rechargeable. Uh, you plug it in, you know, give it a couple of hour charge, you're good to go. And then all I do to, to get a bit to come out is I just push it forward. Did you see that? So if I want to change the bits, and it actually rotates just like a revolver if you were using, you know, in, in, a, in a gun or a pistol, only this is a tool. So as I switch it, and I'm, if you guys can come in close, you'll see, and I'll do it this way, that the bits change every time I move it. All right, I'm getting a different bit. I never have to worry about changing them out. I, it's, all I have to do is just cock it when I need. So if I'm doing you know, a, certain, you know, a flathead bit here, if I'm doing a, a um, Phillips set over here, I've got every bit that I need and I get two of these. We're also giving you the extender driver. This allows you to use this in and around corners, around doorknobs. Basically it plugs into one end and the other end will rotate. So if you need to get into a cracker or crevice, you can actually turn it so that it makes the gun easier to use. That is included. We put it on sale and it's free shipping and handling, $49.95. Matt, why don't you take us on a, on a tour of how we're gonna be able to utilize this because I, I have I've one of these things at home. I tell you, I picked out all items that I had today. I love it. It's convenient. It's easy. And I never have to fumble with the bits. This is it, guy. I'll tell you, this is like having an entire toolbox at the top of the ladder. You can put the numbers on around the house. All the things that get loose, this is the great solution. All your hardware, all the things. Uh, this is a kickstand for a door. Now, this is all Phillips head. Now, watch. To go to a flathead, which is just for this... Uh, this switch plate right here, all I'm gonna do is pop it once. There's my flathead onboard LED light, right? Then you switch it again. Now I've got this open so that I can take, there's, here's this flexible shaft. This is really cool. I'm gonna show you a couple demos real quick. This is a loose doorknob, right? If you took the big guy and you put this in here, you're gonna end up scratching the doorknob, which is what you're trying to replace, watch. Look at this, here's that flexible shaft. And all I do, just like that, the flexible shaft, now the doorknob is completely tight. Take a look here. This is maybe worth the price of admission. This is like having an extra set of hands. This is the special attachment you only get at HSN. It holds the screw for you. Here's a little hook. I'm trying to put it in the wall, but I'm missing one of the, one of the screws. Look at this. It's holding the screw. I can tighten that down. Now I'm completely tight. Even if I want to go backwards and I want to take that screw out, with that screw holder on there, look at this guy. Can you imagine? I didn't drop it. That's it. That's how easy it is to use. The works has thought of everything. Guy, this is, 
This is one of the best drivers I've ever seen at my time at HSN. This is incredible. Well, and again, you know, you're always looking for the right bit. That, that's really the, to, to what sold this to me was having to switch out bits and then having them fall out constantly. When you're, and then if you lose one, you're, you know, you're screwed. These all stay right in the little revolver chamber. So you're never gonna lose them. When you run out of power, you plug it in. I just leave mine plugged in when I'm not using it. And having that little yep. holder, uh, and that, that was a great close up of it, shows you exactly how it sets the bit right into the screw and you're ready to go. I love the whole idea of having it like a revolver. It makes it so smart. And you won't, you'll find the exact bit that you need because even though you, know, you may be needing a Phillips uh, head, they're all different sizes. You know, I actually have, there's a little knob on my stove that has the smallest little Phillips uh, opening there. And you, you can't use the big Phillips head. So you get a variety of every one of those. Because remember, we are giving, two, giving you two of the little revolver chambers. You're getting the extender. And you know, we don't make a big enough deal about this extender, but this thing is a really, really big deal. Let me give you an example. So let's, let's uh, I don't know if we have a, I don't know if you guys can follow me. I'm trying to find a, Brett, where's a doorknob? Do we have one close or do I have to go all the way over there? Can you reach me? Never mind. Oh, duh, right in front of me. There's one right here. <laughs> all right, so, so here's the idea. If you had to get into these screws right there, right? You, you, you can't go straight in because if you go straight in, you're gonna go there. This allows you to bend and be able to get in to wherever it is that you need to get in so you can get around corners. You will attach your, uh, your driver to this and now I can get around corners. I can get in hard to reach areas. If you're doing automotive work, you also know how hard it is to get into some areas of your, of your vehicle. You can access those as well. I, I've also done a, a several ceiling fans. They are so hard to get into some of those little nooks and crannies, but when you've got the extender, it makes it very easy. $49.95, brand new HSN credit card, drops it down to $39.95. We're doing free shipping and handling on this. And I think, you know, listen, you're not gonna build a house with this, but you are gonna do repair work. You are gonna do do-it-yourself projects. It's easy for anybody to handle. The pistol grip is also very easy on your hands. I don't know how many of you out there or seniors, and maybe you've got arthritis or you've got you know, carpal tunnel or one of those things, try using a regular screwdriver. That's really hard. But when you just have to grip and pull the trigger, and you can hear it, it's very quiet, that is That's easy. It. All right, because I'm not doing this with my hand. I'm just letting the, I'm just letting the tool do it. All right, and if I want to change it, I just, there's the smaller one. Now I've got the smaller one right there when I, when I want to use that. Remember it also has a light built in, so if you cannot see where, where you're working, that is brilliant as well. Matt, with free shipping and handling today, another one I think everybody should put in their cart. I'm telling you, this is it. You know, that ready to assemble furniture comes with a little, I call it the knuckle buster where you're trying to put everything together. Well, we've included all those bits with, as well. So there's the larger, they call it a hex head bit. Now here's a little bit smaller hex head bit. Well, what if they throw a square bit at you? You know what, no problem. We've got that covered as well. So all the things that you need, all the different attachments that you can think of, you've got it with the works. And there's that screw holder again. We talked about this before. So if you wanna put a screw down inside a piece of wood, you don't have to have your fingers down in there. You can do it yourself. Look, I'm gonna do it backwards on live TV. There's that screw coming out of there and the screw holder grabs the screw for you so you're not losing it. How great is that? This is from Works, so the ready to assemble furniture. The tight spaces, look at this. I'm gonna do that again with the flexible. I'm with you, Guy. I remember years and years ago, there was a brand on HSN that I represented. I loved them, and they made great quality products, but they had a flexible shaft like this, but it was an extra $19.99. You had to order it separately. Now you've got this in with the, the folks at works. I mean, if you have one of these old, these old things and they're underpowered, they're not gonna get down there into the tight spaces. But with the works, with that flexible shaft on there, you've got it. They even give you a bit, and guy, I don't know if I've got time, but I wanna show you real quick. There's even a bit, I don't know if you have it there at, at, the, at the studio, but it's a tiny little screw, it's a tiny little drill bit. And all it does is it's perfect because it just starts it. It just starts where you want to put that screw. So perfect. look at this. So now I've got a perfect starting hole. So now listen to that power from work. Now I've got the screw exactly where I want it. This is, I mean, they thought of everything with this works SD driver. You're going to love this. And a variety of different um, um, screws that you'll be able to utilize with this. And you see, we set them all up here. So whether it's hex, whether it's flat, whether it's screwdriver, there's so many different uh, bolts that are included on here and it makes it so easy. And remember, you've got that built-in light. 
So when you're, when you're doing your projects, you'll be able to see, and you can see that light, I'm just kind of blinking it on and off. And there you go, you can see the torque on that if I wanna take it out. Very, very easy. So much easier than a traditional screwdriver. There's the light that's built in there. And then if I wanna change it, all I do is change, there's a little flat head, or there's a hex. If I wanna go to flat head, I can do that as well. There's the smaller one, you can see how tiny that is. So if I'm doing flat head, very, and you can see it. See how small that is? Because some things like, that's the little screw on my stove that's on the stove knob that needs to be tightened. All I gotta do is go in, and I'm good to go. And I'm obviously, on the, on the grip, it gives you the forward and reverse so you can do whatever you want. All these are included. These are all the bits that are included. I knocked one over, so I'm standing back up. Nah, he doesn't want to stand. Uh, but anyway, you get all those in two of these uh, little cartridges. You get the extender to go with that. You get all this at $49.95. You're gonna use this all the time, all right? Projects at home, fix-ups, you're gonna love it. Matt Davis, great job, buddy. Good to see you. Thanks, Guy. Great to see you. Happy New Year, everybody. DIY tool, this is it, 2022. You're gonna love it. Got my DIY outfit on. See, that's, this is what I'm wearing. <laughs> all right, thank you, Matt. Hey, uh, are we gonna shift right in, uh, Jared, to our next item? Let's go right over. So, uh, I wanna explain a couple of quick things here. So, um, when I first saw this item, I didn't really, I wasn't really sure. I was like, well, you know what? And then I brought it and I brought it home. And I went and I used it around the base of each toilet, just like that. It is amazing. It is a seal around the toilet. It completes the look of the toilet. It keeps the funk and the gunk from going in those cracks and crevices. You can use this at the base of walls. You can use it as trim anywhere. It's got a super uh, sticky adhesive on one side, and then it, it has this flexible, I'll hold it like this for you. It's flexible on the top. And you can see right here, see how that flexes? So that when I go into a corner, and I'll move this table back, like this. When I go like this and I, I, I haven't removed the adhesive, all I need to do is push that down just like that. I'll show you like that. I'll make sure I get the flaps out just like that. And that's going to create a seal between this and down here. Uh, what you are getting is you're getting two jumbo rolls of this. All right. It's called InstaTrim. I have it available in three colors. I have not had the white in months, we just got the white back. And I'm telling you, it's what everybody wants because a lot of people do their tub, they do their sink, they do their kitchen sink. But if you're doing walls or trim area, a lot of people like the brown or they like the gray. I have all those available. Uh, you are gonna get a boatload of this stuff. You actually get, uh, let's see, <clears throat> I think you get 10 feet, you get 20 feet total. So it's enough to do a bunch of rooms in the house. So you're gonna get two 10 foot rolls. Um, it is self-adhesive. All you need to do is cut it and peel it away. Uh, the inventor of this uh, product, who has been in this business for a long, long time, uh, is my good buddy, Rick Wood. Rick, we finally got it back. It's been out of stock for so long. You know I love this project because A, it's easy, B, it really, really works, and it makes everything look so perfectly finished. Here's Rick Wood to tell us about it. Hey, buddy. It absolutely does. Well, uh, you know, Guy, I'm still coming to you from that construction site. I, you know, I've been asking for you to come over and help out a little <laughs> bit. Um, about literally 12 seconds ago, the plumber just walked out the door. He's waiting outside because he wants to get paid. But um, we're, we're uh, brand new countertops. They're about 14 hours old. And we uh, have been redoing the house and using InstaTrim in places that I never even thought of before. Uh, but I just want to show you, when you look at this, you, you know, how many times do you see a countertop like this? And you see the ugly seam in the back. And we could put the white trim in. Looks really nice. I mean, that seam just went away with the, with the white trim. Or I've taken a lot of the adhesive off so I can pull this off easily. Or we use the gray. But around here, I've used it outside. We have a... Um, uh, we have an actual um, uh, cage around our pool deck, and where the aluminum comes to the deck, it's kind of an ugly gap. Yeah. And so I put the gray around there because our pool deck is a super light gray. And so I use the uh, gray InstaTrim around that whole area. Because things move at a different rate, there's all kinds of things going on. It gets dirt. We have to uh, wash it down. It looks freaking awesome. Yeah. Um, we used it in another area where the aluminum comes down uh, on a shower stall. But my favorite, your favorite, I know. And, Guy, we have to tell everybody 
you name this. Yeah. This is what we call this now. This is the Insta Trim crown molding for your toilet. This, that's your term. Look <laughs> at the toilet before. This ugly gap yeah. between the floor and the toilet. And you know what gets in there. You've got the kids, and yeah. you know, we've got the kids. Now we put the Insta Trim. Look at this. Look. On there, look at the wow. difference in that. Yeah, and Is you know that what? Incredible. Yeah, and Rick, that took literally. It takes about 60 seconds to do that. Uh, you know, I actually cut a little piece because I want everybody to know you don't need any kind of caulk. You don't need any kind of a glue. It has this mega adhesive on it. All you do, and if you can come into my hands, I'll show you. There's the strip, and what I've done is I'm going to peel this back. That just comes off just like that. And then what you wanna do is you just wanna work it into a corner, just like this. And I'll just do this, uh, this area of the table. And you'll see it has these flaps on either side. What I wanna do is I wanna push down just like that. All right, and run my finger on it. That creates the seal on the floor. And uh, let's pretend this is the side of the toilet. And guess what, gang, I am done. All right, this is, a, this is completely sealed and smooth. I didn't have to worry about anything. What I did with my, with my two toilets, and I'll I, I tell you, even Danny was like, Dad, that looks awesome. Because what gets in around that little toilet area, there's all kinds of various, you know, oh, everything can get in under there and it's nasty, right? I mean, you know what I'm talking about. You know your kids don't have the best aim, and then you got all kinds of hair, God knows what. You don't want to deal with that. You want to seal it off. So when you do that, you're making it, a, in my opinion, a more sanitary toilet, but that's it. That's why you buy it. What if you've got a door jam, right? Maybe you got a little, a, a little uh, you know, cold air coming in a jam, and you're like, you know what? I want to seal that up around a window. Uh, maybe it's around a screen door. Wherever you've got two surfaces, but let me give you a tip, and Rick tells you this as well. What I did before I did around the toilet, I took a little rubbing alcohol and I put it on a little bit of paper towel and I just went around. You wanna make sure you have no moisture around there and if there's anything nasty, the rubbing alcohol will get rid of that and then when that dries, then you just run that around in that, in that little oval thing. It's awesome. You get two rolls of this, 20 feet. This is a project that'll make a big difference and I'll tell you, take a before picture of your toilet, you should send it to me, post it on uh, Facebook, I'd love to see it. Uh, but the before and afters are like day and night and Rick, I, I love that you made it easy, right? You, know, no, you don't have to get any tubes of goop, you don't have to scrape anything out, just give it a clean and put it on, it's that simple. Difference, I mean, uh, and one thing, uh, probably acetone is the best if you can get a nail polish remover. Um, acetone is the best to clean up. You know, uh, throughout this house, we have a uh, laminate floor. And laminate floors, a lot of people are using laminate floors these days, they have this soft pad on the back of them. When we put that up next to the molding, the molding goes over it, it's constantly moving and it moves at a different rate. You put caulk in there, I guarantee you in six months it's gonna be open, it's gonna crack and it's gonna look ugly. With the Insta Trim, I showed you how the adhesive went right into the corner, but the wings, those flaps, have no adhesive. They are allowing that movement, because you can't stop the movement. Caulk doesn't stop movement, nothing stops that difference in movement but we want to allow that movement to happen. So once you do this, it's a very permanent fix to a long time problem. I also brought my uh, favorite caulking gun, and I don't know how well you can see this, but it is, there's as much caulk on the outside of this gun, <laughs> which came from my hands, right. as, uh, as went on any project. So the trick is, this is clean, it's easy, cut it with a pair of scissors, Peel back the uh, protective coating on the adhesive. Yeah. Put it in place. Make sure yeah. you rub it down. If you don't get it perfect, you can, you know, there's no reason. You yeah, can you can pull it up. Pick it up. Yeah. Pull it up, and, and you can come right back into place and make it nice and straight. You Looks know, great. Rick, you want to contrast, you yeah. want it to blend. I'm, I, you know, you being a professional, I'm glad you talked about that, about having it to be, having it flexible. You know, you have variations in temperature, so things shrink. And when you, if you use regular caulk, that's why caulk cracks right? A lot of it will dry out and it's cracked. This will not dry out on you. It gives you that great seal. You don't have to worry about curing or any of that crud. You know, hey, listen, if you're a professional contractor, you can worry about that stuff. You're a homeowner. You just want your toilet to look nice, right? You don't want to have that grungy, green, nasty kind of, uh, you know, film underneath. What about around a sink? You know, maybe, and, and you know, if you've got a basin sink like that, that's perfect for that. Uh, anywhere around any plumbing that you want to seal, you can utilize this, all right? 
Try it. You're going to get 20 feet of it. It's probably more than you need. But, you know, you, you're going to wind up getting addicted to it. You'll be like, you know, I, I'd like to even seal the, the corners of where the uh, wall meets the floor there. Not everybody has, you know, paneling down there. Not everybody has crown moldings. That's why I right, so said to Rick, it's like crown molding for your toilet. It's crown molding for your tub. Exactly. And it really... It, you know, it's a little detail, Rick, but it makes all the difference. Just kind of like crown molding does, right? You know, crown molding, me, you don't, you don't need it, but it sure looks nice. This you need. And Guy, let me tell you something. Where the, one of the places I used it that I didn't think I'd ever use it was uh, actually um, on my shower where I had an aluminum frame, and that frame came down to the ground um, we're actually going to replace this one, but it was all kind of moldy, uh, old caulk looked terrible. That's another thing caulk does. This will not grow mold. And it, it looked terrible. So my wife says, Rick, why don't you just put the uh, Insta trim in there? I said, yeah, that's not a bad idea. Put the gray Insta trim along the aluminum. It, you don't even see it. You don't, you don't know it's there. It came out clean, neat. It looks absolutely beautiful. It's easy to do. It will go over a lot of things. Uh, like I said, I like the um, more the acetone to uh, clean up everything. Yeah, Nail polish that works. works perfectly. Yep. Yeah, and you can you can really uh, make something look so good, and it's going to stay that way. You can never stop movement, but you have to allow for it. And that's what this does. It's easy. All right, I mean, let's just call it it's smart, it's easy, it looks fantastic. Trust me, this guy's been doing this for a long, long time. And, you know, if you want to spend hundreds of dollars and have some professional come in or you want to do it yourself, remember, it comes in the brown, it comes in the gray. Most people are getting the white. That's a good kitchen or, a kitchen or bathroom color. Uh, we, uh, we load it up on it, so uh, grab as much as you want. 703-764. Rick Wood, the man. It's Thank you, buddy. Paintable. All right, mate. Take care, guy. Great right. seeing you again. You too, partner. Take care. 7300764. Hey, zip snip. If you just join us, it was like that was what I came out of the gate with. It's easily, it's probably in my top three all time favorite purchases from HSN. All right. If you know me and my Facebook friends know me, if you don't, you just try it for 30 days. I guarantee you will not return it. You'll be like, wow. No more tough scissors. No more sore fingers. I can go through carpeting. I can go through leather. I can go through almost anything with this. Paper, what about gifts? And you gotta wrap things and you're tearing all the wrapping paper. If you're a crafter, you'll love it. Your kids can use it, it's safe. You can't get little fingers in that little way because there's a little guard there. It never needs sharpening. It re it's rechargeable. I've recharged mine once in two years and I use it every day. <laughs> I know the battery is probably way more than the little cutter needs, but if you're a senior and you have issue cut uh, with, with using scissors, get this, you'll love it. I promise. 714273 is the item number there. All right, man, this hour is going back. I get to work with, with my, one of my favorite people of all time, my friend Jared is producing our show today. So I wanna say hello to my friend Jared. He's helping us get everything organized here today. And uh, you can't hear him, but he said hello. Uh, we wanna, we wanna uh, talk about um, decorating in your home. This was launched, and I believe I'm the person that launched this a couple years ago, taking the world by storm. Because what's one of the hardest things to do when you're decorating around your house? Hanging a picture. If you're alone you, and you're trying to measure it out, you're like, well, I, I gotta put two nails in. How do I do that? How do I make it even every time? This is called the hangman. <laughs> this is the push and hang picture hanging tool. I will tell you, everybody in the studio when we use it is impressed with us. What it is, it's an automatic way to measure in distance from nail to nail and to be able to make sure it's level at the same time. And the nails are loaded into the device itself. All you do is line it up and push, and you have two or one perfectly set nails. All right, I want you to take a look at mine. I've got mine right here. All right, so here we are, this is, this is it. So basically what you do is you've got, you basically got what is the equivalent of a metal ruler, and then in the middle there, if you look right where, where I'm gonna make sure I can hold this without trying, see right here, that's a level. So I, I, it's, in order to be able to hang a picture, I need to have that in the middle, so I know how to tilt it. Once you get that in the middle, you are perfectly level, and then you simply push, and your two nails, which are loaded in here, go right in the wall. I've never, I, I wish I invented this, it's the smartest, 
hardest things I've ever seen. Michael uh, Van uh, Horst is waiting by or standing by. Michael, we've brought this back year after year after year. For I'll tell you, for about a $20 bill, this is one of the best investments you'll ever make if you hang pictures in your house, and we all do that. Welcome to our show, buddy. You're the inventor. Tell everybody about it. Guy, how you doing? Good to see you again. You too, yeah, man. You're absolutely right, you know. <laughs> For the cost of this tool, you're just going to spend more just go out and buying a hammer, right? And how many of us hate using tools? We either hit our thumb with a hammer, we don't like using tools. You know, guy, I've been, I've been doing real estate 25 years, and I see more pictures on the floor than I see on the wall. And why is that? Because people are uncomfortable with it. They just don't like to get up. They procrastinate. It takes them a long time to get it on the wall. Well, look at this. I came up with push and saying... So anybody can use it, whether you're young, old, live alone in a dorm. If you can use a stapler, you can use push and hang. Look how simple this is. This, like you said, you're simply gonna walk up to the wall. Now look at this. I'm not grabbing any tools whatsoever. I'm making sure that bubble level is in the center. One quick little punch like motion and I'm done. I've already put two nails in the wall, just like that. All at the right angle, Love all it. at the right depth perfectly level every time you're going to use it that's why everybody's loving this and let me show you another thing on why everybody's loving this so much and why it's so simple not only does it has a floating level on top in the middle of it but it has a magnetic cylinder that holds all your extra nails for you and look at that they're not going to fall out when you walk around the house so all you do with this tool is you take a nail each one of the handles like you said has a magnetic cylinder in it so as soon as you hold the nail up you hear that click it drew the nail in for you automatically. How fun is that? So again, you can walk around your house, you can go anywhere you want, and the nails aren't gonna walk out. So let's say you've got a picture on the back side of a picture, right? That's got those awful crimps or eyelets on the back of a picture that we all hate. Well, look at this. It's got an indicator on the top of each one of the handles. You line up the first one, slide it across, and look at that, it's already preset and ready to go. It does everything for you. It not only marks the wall, it puts two nails in the wall, and it makes it perfectly level each and every time you use it. And just like I said before, if you can use a stapler, you can use push and hang, guy. That's how easy and simple it is, and that's why everybody's loving it so much. You know what, I I, I, I address this all the time because you know my mom is, my mom's 89, she's gonna be 90, and her husband is 87, and they're not gonna grab a hammer and nails and they're not gonna go up and try to measure. They're both on walkers right now. And, and I mean, they can get around, but they could easily use this because all you do is you put the nail, the magnetic nail in each one of the holes. If you're using, uh, you know, if, if you just need a single nail, you only need one, you can slide it off. You go over to the wall and you push. It's all that you need to do. And, and I, I showed you before, here it is. When I bring it over to the wall, you'll see I've got two nails already loaded in here. All I do is I push, so imagine this is up against the wall, and there is the nail right there. It's not gonna fall out, it's magnetic. It stays inside there until it pushes in the wall board. That's all you need to do. So if I do two at once, there they are. There's my two nails going in. I've measured them right here. I know that they're level. It's brilliant. In fact, my, uh, I was just, we were mentioning Jared. Jared just bought it. My producer just bought it, Michael. He's like, I gotta get one of these things. I mean, for, for about 20 bucks, how many times have you put a nail in a wall and then you put another one in and you hang the picture and your partner comes over and goes, what are you, blind? That's like, like this, what do you, you know? Like, how did you mess that up? If you've got this, you can never mess it up. In fact, professionals, they use a level, Michael, when they hang pictures. I mean, they, they are smart enough. They know that that's the way to do it. Otherwise, you just muck up the wall. This is an easy way to hang pictures for $21. I love it. Michael, show me some more. I can move Absolutely, on. just like you said, you know, the level is built into it, you know. So it goes into any sheetrock or drywall surface, which is most surfaces in every home in America. Uh, even if you have something that's a hard surface, this doubles as a marking tool. So you're going to be able to mark it, and it's going to be perfectly level when you use it. Now, let's talk about that single nailer. You know, we keep that in every drawer in the house, but I'll tell you what, we use it all the time. You just simply clip off the end cap just like so, slide off one of the handles. Now, look at anything that you can imagine, up to five pounds, you've got the single nailer. And guess what? This takes less than a second. Now, look at this. I'm just going to walk up to the wall. Less than a second, I put that in there just like that. It already put the nail in the right angle in depth and go ahead and hang that craft item. Super simple, super easy. Again, if you can use a stapler, 
you can lose cushion hang. Now look at how easy and simple that is. In less than a couple of seconds, you've got all your decorations up. And let's hope that you took your Christmas decorations down and we're ready for springtime. I love it. You know, if you go to hsn.com, mostly five-star reviews. Uh, by the way, you are getting 62 nails. We give you the nails and then you have enough right on the actual uh, unit. There's a place to store nails. So, you know, you can just keep this aside when you're doing them. You pop the nails out. Uh, magnetically, they go inside. You just load them in upside down. And then when you're ready to go, all you do is give it a push. It has never been easier. Uh, $7.32 is your flex pay. If you want to get this for $11.95, get a brand new HSN credit card. We'll put $10 in your account and you can pick it up. I, you know, Michael, for me, I just love items like this because it's everybody has a need for it. It's not like, I mean, you're not going to walk into somebody's home and they're not going to have pictures, right? So everybody, it's like, you know, when I was just doing the trim for around the toilets, everybody's got a toilet in their house, so everybody can use it. Our zip snip, everybody uses scissors. So these are really like for everybody out there, and I love that you invented it. I love that you're making it easier for anybody. Even kids can learn how to hang their own pictures because they don't have to grab a big hammer. They don't have to take a nail. They're not gonna screw up three or four times where you have to go over and patch the wall. It's easy. Anybody can do it. And Michael, I can use it double or single, correct? Oh, absolutely, yeah. If you use two nails, which is the double, you can do anything up to 10 pounds. If you slide it off or use a single handle, anything up to five pounds, you know? So I challenge all of my realtor friends out there as well, because I've been a realtor. This is the number one closing gift where I live for realtors. When I hand over the keys and I get them one of these, their eyes get about twice as big. They absolutely love it. But to clip off the end cap and be able to slide something off, never yeah. grab a handle, handle a hammer again, it's just right there for you. But I want to show you one thing real quick, guy. Sure. This, you know, don't let these little, don't let these little nails fool you. Because this thing will hold as, as big as a four by four foot canvas wrap. Now, we use this for everything in our house. Everything that we hang uh, is with this pushing hang. And look at this. Once again, I walk up to the wall. Now, I want to show you this picture. This is not a little tiny picture. This thing is huge, you know. So, uh, once again, perfectly level each and every time you use it. And you can use it for all different things that you can imagine. Not only pictures, craft items, calendars. Now that's 2022. Uh, uh, kids use it for their craft items at school. Like I said, if you live alone, if you live in a dorm room where they don't like big holes in the walls, this is perfect for you. You just take a little tiny spackle on your fingertip to cover it up. You don't even have to paint it. You don't even see that nail hole because it goes in the right angle and depth. So it's so simple, guys. It's just so easy. Everybody loves it. Hey, Michael, tell me about the nails themselves. Because I know a lot of people are watching and they're like, well, you know, what kind of nails can I use? Can you explain that? Because I know these, these look like the regular standard picture hanging nails. Absolutely. It takes, it takes a number 17 Brad nail, pick it up at any hardware store. If you're looking at it right there, I know you got your cover on yours, but it's also stamped right in there, right in, your, right in, the, in the front there. It's called the number 17 Brad nail. You can pick it up at every, any hardware store. Uh, we're also giving you an extra 50 that, that, that comes with it. So you can, you, you can do 62 items singly with this, or you can put up 30 pictures in a matter of seconds. You're going to love it. All right, if you want it, again, 711476 is the item number. I just think, you know, hey, listen, if you got to hang pictures, why not do it the right way? Why go back and have to cover up holes? You know, I, I, it, it's, it's amazing. I use it more single than I do double. I used it for holiday decorations as well. So you're really going to love it. Get it home um, at $21.95. It's a steal. Michael, great to see you again, my friend. Absolutely, guys. We'll see you again, and thank you so much for having me on. You bet you, Happy buddy. Happy New Year. Happy New Year, pal. 711-476. All right, let's get right into painting. So I own a Wagner Power Painter. I've had mine for six years, seven years maybe, and I love it. I never, uh, I very rarely paint with a brush. I do a little cutting in with brushes, but I, for the bulk of my painting, I use Wagner. They're the number one name out there. This is our top of the line Flexio. Uh, the reason we call it the Flexio uh, is well, well, a couple of reasons we do, because it's so easy to use uh, and it'll go anywhere and everywhere, but also the fact that the compressor actually is a little, tr uh, basically sits on the ground. So you don't have to use the weight of the compressor in your hand. You are getting two paint sp sprayers included with this, all right? You are getting um, spray shields, you're getting the 15 feet of hose, because remember the compressor just sits on the ground while you're doing your painting. This is their number one 
it's the best way, in my opinion, to paint any project. First of all, it's clean. No more, uh, no more buckets. All you do is you take your paint, you pour it in. Put the top on, plug it in, start spraying. You can adjust the, uh, the paint spray. Uh, they have this little Vario uh, nozzle at the end where you can actually adjust the direction right here. So if you want to go up and down, or if you want to go left to right, you simply give it a little twist and that, that will control the, uh, the spray. You can use any type of paint in here. So whether you're using thicker paints, uh, milk paints, whether you're using stain, uh, you can use stain inside here as well. In my opinion, it's so much easier with a brush or a roller, you're up and down, you're down on the ground. With a paint sprayer, that's it. It's so easy. You can go up or down like this. You don't have to worry about it. You're using less paint because you're aerating the paint. You're not getting a gloopy, like nasty mess, right? You're not gonna get any lines when you're painting. So whether you're doing your deck, a wall, a door, furniture, crafting projects, you get even spray every time. They dropped the price even lower than I, my price that I had was 189. I am seeing this for the first time. They dropped the price to 169. And because uh, on my flow sheet, it says 189. Uh, so they dropped the price even more. It is free shipping and handling limited to our special guest. His name is Luke Caputo, and I want you all to prepare yourself to be wowed by how quickly and what the beautiful results Lou will get. Lou, Happy New Year, buddy. I haven't God. seen you. Yeah, I know. Happy New Year to you. Happy I don't know where you've been. I missed you, man. I was on vacation. <laughs> <laughs> Good for you. I love to hear that. Yeah, this, this right here, first of all, yes, you paid more, okay? You don't have to now. Uh, this is the most powerful flex that we've ever made. I love it because all the weight's on the ground. So all I'm doing is carrying something that weighs less than a milk jug in my hands right now, okay? I'm going to paint this door real quick, and then I'm going to do this wicker chair. Um, and I want to show you how fast this can do these jobs, okay? So um, the first thing I've got to do is I've got to bend down. I'm going to turn on the uh, turbine. Then I've got a trigger here that's going to actually release the paint. Watch this. Watch how quickly I can do this. So you hear it come on right there, right? Now watch this. We're going to come over to the door. And watch how quickly, there we go, I can paint this up and down, just like that guy. Now, it's painting this very evenly. It's getting a beautiful coat of paint on here. I'm gonna be able to do one pass on this in just a couple of seconds. There's not gonna be any rollers, there's no brushes, there's no stippling involved. I don't have to worry about any of that. Right down to the bottom, let's make sure we got the whole edge and voila, Boom. we are done. Now. Look at that right there, how fast it was. It's gonna dry faster and I'm using less paint to get the job done. Let's move on to the wicker chair real quick. And the reason I wanna do that is, watch how fast you can knock out projects. Wicker's a nightmare. Nobody wants to paint wicker, okay? Cause it's got all these nooks and crannies and voids. So again, all we're gonna do is just turn on the turbine, the X-Boost turbine, the most powerful that we've got. And then watch how quickly I can paint this chair. And you know what's nice about this too, is this is something that you'd actually put off for a long time to do because, you know, when you have to paint wicker, there's a lot of stippling that has to go on here. You're in there with the brush, you're working twice as hard. All I'm doing is just guiding the wow. Wagner Flexio 4000. Guy, look at this, okay, ready? <laughs> yeah. Let's call that done. What I do, two, two <laughs> different projects in about hey, Lou. two minutes? Lou, Lou, <laughs> can you imagine doing that with a paintbrush? How long? No. First of all, you'd probably, you'd probably have half your paint would wind up on the floor because it would go in all the little That's cracks right. and crevices. That's it's right. the only way to do a wicker chair, right? What about like, uh, you ever painted like shutters? There are so many little cracks and areas in a shutter that are so hard to get to that you have to get you know, the stippling brush and you gotta do all this and you gotta do all that. When you've got Wagner, you don't have to do that. Now, I know a lot of you out there are, a lot of you doubters are like, it can't be that easy. Let me tell you, I bought my first Wagner like six or seven years ago. I was shocked and I did the whole, I actually use it on my, uh, outside of my screen porch. I did the entire stucco outside of my screen porch. And by the way, you can't do, you can't paint stucco out exterior with anything but a sprayer. You can't roll it, can't paint it with a brush. You have to use a sprayer. So, and, and the reason you wanna do that is first of all, you don't want a gloppy mess. It's the only way to really get good coverage, but because a sprayer, just like a pressure washer gets in every crack and crevice. It goes where a brush can't go. It goes where a roller can't go. It goes in and around corners. And Lou, I may be mistaken, but I think you told me the last time, you, you yeah. wind up using less paint with this system. Do you do? 
Yeah, you do. When you inject the air into this, you actually use less product. Because when you're using a brush and a roller, it's wasteful. It's a very wasteful process. Um, and then you got to go back and you got to put multiple coats on. With your Wagner, you're probably going to get one coat done. I mean, you can paint a whole room, four corners of, uh, four walls of a room. By the time you do get back to the first wall guy, it's already dry. Okay, so that's pretty amazing with this. But the other thing is the customizability of this. And this is something that you've seen on Wagner's before. This one's even more so. If you look at this right here, and you were talking about this a, a moment ago, on top of this, I can vary the stream of this, like how wide or how narrow that stream's gonna be, okay? So I can do that. Uh, right here, I can control whether I'm going up and down or side to side. Back here, I can control how much product I'm actually using that's going through there. And of course, you've got your trigger down here. This all breaks down, by the way, in five minutes and five pieces. It's so simple to clean. But here's the thing that's new. Right here, we've got a dial on the turbine itself so you can control the pressure, the force that's coming out of the turbine even. So this one is the most customizable we've ever done. Now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna paint this fence right here, okay? So I'm gonna, I'm gonna gradually stand up. I'm gonna turn this on, you ready? And we're going to paint the fence, all right? Here we go. Watch this, I'm gonna go up to the top of the fence here. And now you know that wood sucks up anything you put on it. I'm actually using stain right now, guy. This isn't even paint and it's not diluted. And that's something you can't do with most of your sprayers out there, but the Wagner, this is not a problem. And I want you to see how I could do one coat of paint or one coat of stain rather on this, just like that. And the nice thing about this is that you can use stains, you can use chalk paint, milk paint, latex paint, varnishes, anything wow. you want. Look at that and we're gonna call that done. Look at that. Now, Guy, imagine, hot summer day, how fast did I just paint my hey. entire yard all the you're, way around? You're making Huck Finn jealous. Look at how quickly he painted that fence. I <clears> mean, <throat> honestly, you know, when it comes to painting, I don't think there's anybody that thinks painting is, like, super relaxing. No, you know, it's not no. something you want to do for three hours, okay? It really nope. isn't. You know, there are certain uh, chores that you do. I like fishing. I could go out fish for hours. And I, Painting is one of those things you just want to get it done. So time is money. All right, when you watch anybody out there that paints for a living, how many of them use a brush? How many of them use a roller? A roller? Very few. All right, maybe to do some really rough... They know that they're saving paint by using a, a power sprayer. They're saving time. They get better results, all right, because it's even, because you're not glopping paint on there. Even with a roller, you're glopping paint. They do it because it, it, it literally it's the best way to paint. And when you think about, Lou, you know, the, the projects in your house, th these are big projects. I mean, if you, wanted to, oh, yeah. if you wanted to spray paint your garage, the exterior of your garage, I have a shed. I have a good sized shed. If I painted that with a roller, it would take me four hours. If I use a sprayer, day. it would probably take me 30 minutes. I mean, literally, yeah. the, only, the only thing would be I have to add more paint from time to time. That's the That's only it. downtime. That's it. But I mean, yeah. Lou, you can't go wrong with this. No, you can't. And the nice thing is you're getting two different nozzles with this, okay? So this one that I've been using is called the eye spray. You're also getting what we call the detail nozzle. It's a much finer spray that comes out of this one. It's a little bit easier to control. But I'm going to show you right now how we can do a big project. Part of it I'm going to use the detail, part of it I'm going to use the eye spray. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to paint the railing right here, okay? Because we decided it's summer, we're going to freshen things up. So here we go. I'm going to turn this on. Already got my paint loaded in here. And I want you to see how fast I can do this whole railing. Look at this. And what's nice about it is that it's spray on demand. So if I decide, okay, I want to take a look at it and stop, I can. If I want to hit the spray again, I can. All right, now, what I'm going to do is turn this off. I'm going to switch out the spray cups. All you've got to do is there's a little tab here. You press down, you rotate the handle, it comes off. By the way, this hose is 15 feet long. So you've got more than enough to like leave it in the center of the room and just walk around the whole thing. I'm going to put this on here. You're going to hear this click into place. Boom, just like that. We've now switched out. So you can switch out paint colors. I mean, there's so many ways you can use this, but I want the big nozzle to do the deck, right? Watch this. You know, and I recently painted a deck guy with this. I used stain on mine. Look at that. This is paint. But my gosh, dude, it saved me so much time. Now look at that. Wow. I wouldn't even go over that a second time. No. That's enough paint right there. Done. I'm having a beer now. Yeah, I mean, well, you know, it's easy. The reason I, a lot of people, and by the way, if you want to put a couple coats on, you can, but more often than not, the reason Absolutely. that people will put two coats on something is because it's uneven. Because you've got hand pressure, roller pressure, brush pressure. So you, so you see marks, it's all uneven, so they go over it again. When you do it yeah. right the first time, nine out of 10 times, you don't have to do it again. And let's talk about price. If you had somebody, and well, let me say this first, why do you hire somebody to come and paint something for you? Be honest, because it's a pain in the you know what to do it yourself, right? It's hard. You got to haul buckets, you got to get on ladders, you got to do it. When you have a paint sprayer, 
it, it's so much easier, it's ridiculous. I mean, there are very, there are very few things where it's like, wow, it, this is like a hundred times easier. And you get to do it yourself and you get to do it on your schedule. And you're not paying a painter. Like if I had somebody come paint my shed, probably cost me $1,000. That's what I would, for supplies, probably seven or $800 to paint it. They would probably be out there for three or four hours, but they're not gonna come out and do a job for 200 bucks, right? I could do it myself. If I own the sprayer with a couple of gallons of paint, I could do it myself and I could do it when I want. I mean, it really is a great, I mean, I know it's a little bit of an investment, but get it, whether you're the painter, your husband, your wife, your partner, whoever does those kind of jobs, they will love this. And I will tell you, I was very concerned about cleanup. When I bought yeah. mine and I went to, I even talked to Lou, because Lou is the one I bought it off. I said, Lou, I don't want to be soaking things and you know, worry. Lou, would you explain the, the uh, cleanup when we're done? Yeah, no, absolutely. This breaks down to five pieces and it takes literally five minutes from the time you break it down to the time you just wash it in any kind of soapy water and then it's good to go. I mean, it's the easiest thing to do and you don't wash all of it. All you're doing is just washing the head end right here and the paint cup, that's it. The rest of this is good to go. You never have to worry about it. So if you think about it, guy, the time you spend going to the store to buy rollers, to buy trays, you know what yeah. I mean? You don't have to worry about all that now because when you want to paint, you can paint, you got it there. And I'll tell you something, and when I first got this, the, the very first Wagner I sold, it came with this detail cup right here, the detail sprayer. Kelly, my wife Kelly's eyes, she's in the control room right now, her eyes lit up because she's a crafter. All right, let me show you how quickly you can upcycle something. We've got a pot right here. I'm going to take this from drab to amazing in just a second. I'm just going to turn this on. Now watch how quickly I can do this. We're going to start here at the bottom. And just look, watch this. I'm just going to go around this. And it makes it so, so simple to do. Look at that. That's awesome. Do the whole thing in just a couple Look seconds. You. Boom, and you're done. <laughs> I mean, this thing is a crafter's delight. Everybody out there, if you're a crafter, you know somebody, you got to get this. I, I just had an image of you like on a potter's wheel just there. I don't know. It just... <laughs> Lou, the, Lou the sculptor. Listen, whether you're a crafter, you know, you're an avid do-it-yourselfer. You know, listen, I, I, yeah, I could probably afford to get things painted, but you know what? I get much more pleasure out of doing it myself. I really do. You know, it, it's like, I, like even washing my own car. You know, like, like, yeah, I can bring it to the car wash, but I like washing my own car. There, if you enjoy the process, because the process is not hard, then you'll enjoy the end result even more. If the process sucks, you're gonna hire somebody to do it. I mean, listen, you know, let's, I, although I, I, I was gonna say, you know, I'm not gonna grout my own shower, even though I did do that last time. I'll, I'll tell you, I, I don't know if I'd do it again, uh, because grouting and all that is, is, is a tough job. Um, but, but a paint, Paint shouldn't, putting, shouldn't be that hard. We learn to paint when we're little kids, you know, but this is the grown-up version of, of enjoying painting. It really is. And the results, when you see, uh, you know, your deck repainted in, in an hour versus hiring people to come out and do it and charge you $2,000 and you, and you did it for the cost of paint, plus you bought the Wagner, you will be so proud of yourself. And remember, we're talking about interior and exterior. All right, this is not just an indoor painter. That You can paint anything you want. If you want to paint your deck, outdoor furniture. If you want to stain your Adirondack chairs, which I've done with a brush and it's a pain in the backside, all right? And it's no fun. Because first of all, I don't want to be around that smell for hours and hours, which, you know, when you're using a urethane type thing, it's pretty strong. You don't have to do that because you're doing the job faster. You should wear a mask anyway, you know, even when you're not painting, but you get it. So, so you're getting the job done, you're getting the enjoyment of doing it yourself, and you're getting a way to do it that is today is so affordable. Honest to gosh, I, I, I'm not gonna show you my card, but I had 189.95 as the discount. Lou, they dropped the price another $20, and it's free shipping and handling. Take advantage of it, get it now. Lou, we got about a minute left paint a louver door which is something you would never think you could do in a minute but watch this i'm going to turn on my turbine and here we go i've heard i got a lovely shade of blue loaded up today now notice this is actually getting underneath all the louvers as i go down here guys look at this getting down to the bottom just like that and we're done okay wow get a whole louver door in 30 seconds okay wow. i'm going to do a stencil Again, watch this guy, real quick. I know we got time, so I'm just gonna do yeah, one more project. Loose. This is kind of fun though. I'm gonna turn this down. Here we go. Watch this guy. This is my creative side again, guy. This is Crafter Lou right here. Yeah. Ready, here we go. Turn Crafter that off, Lou. time for the big reveal, and ta-da! Wow. Look what I did. 
All right, yeah, you need uh, you get the, the judges give you a 10 for the design, and uh, as far as being graceful, you get a 4.6 on that one. <laughs> My advice, maybe let Kelly, maybe maybe let Kelly do the crafting. Lou, you're wonderful. He's the crafter. Great yeah. job, Lou. Uh, appreciate you Thanks, uh, and all your all your demos were wonderful. Thanks, buddy. I guess he's gone. All right, if you want to get it with free shipping, you can get it, 768038. Stick around, the lovely and talented Colleen Lopez coming your way next. HSN price is a great value that we bring to you every day. We work hard and have the buying power to make sure it's a value that you'll love. So go ahead, treat yourself with the confidence to buy now at the HSN price. Find your new favorites and explore the possibilities on HSN. Refresh your wardrobe with Diane Gilman. Get innovative tools for deep cleaning without the hard work. Plus, free shipping on skincare products and all electronics. Explore the possibilities Saturday at midnight on HSN.